my lions what's going on Tom here from Amazon Lions University we're gonna coin that term okay today how can you differentiate your product so you can sell a lot of items and beat your competition every time that seems to be the most common question that I get and even though I've answered it in my previous reviews uh, videos I feel like I need to touch on this once again so two of my most effective ways to do so here it goes the first thing which I've mentioned in videos before is I spy on my competition I go who my top sellers are I find out what product they're selling that is exactly like the product that I want to sell and I use helium 10 chrome extension to check out their reviews and the reason I do this is to find out the keywords used in the reviews why this is important I want to know what they're doing wrong what the, the reviewers are saying that is wrong with their product the laptop bag example that I've used many times is that I know that my competition was some of them didn't have a strap some of them the zipper was not working it was defective after a while after a while um, it just gave them trouble so I know that when I source my product that I better make sure that it's high quality product and that it is gonna solve those problems and I know that I'm gonna mention those things in my listing to make sure I put the buyers mind at ease when I'm selling my product that is the first way to differentiate is to start from the get-go figure out what is wrong with the product that your competitors are selling and fix it so that your buyers say hey there is a more superior product in the market why would I buy from this guy that has negative reviews well this guy addresses those issues that I've been thinking about right so that's what it is you want to make sure you address the issues that the products are having so people are more comfortable buying from you as opposed to your competition second way the second way we're gonna do this is we are gonna figure out how can we make this product better not only better as in the quality like I talked about the zipper or anything what else could we do with this product that actually will make it better one of the ways with the laptop bag is when I started sourcing laptop bags I didn't just provide a laptop bag I said you know what what if this bag had a different compartment for your mouse a different compartment for the charger so those things are not scratching each other right I immediately improved on that product I saw an opportunity that hey a lot of my uh, a lot of my competition people are mentioning that hey where I put my mouse do I just stick it in the same compartment and a lot of these bags have just one compartment not even a divider or anything so you know what I saw you know what this is a great opportunity to find a supplier that will actually modify the bag based on what I wanted to and that's what I did I started creating bags that had a compartment for your mouse a compartment for your charger so those things don't touch your laptop and it's well protected and at the same time it's a sleek design it's not too much bigger or anything like that so the point or the moral of the story is improve on the product and make it better take it to the next level okay people want to see what else could be done with this product just like Apple guys when they launch a new phone what do they do the first thing they do is put different kind of features because people are not gonna buy the same phone if it's exactly the same even though it's one year newer yes the body parts and stuff are new but why does it matter right if it's not solving some of the problems the previous generation has that's exactly it guys improve and take it to the next level and the third way actually which is a bonus way that I'm gonna tell you guys how to do this is by bundling your product that's how you're gonna create a kind of a different product altogether at the same time upsell to a higher price guys so if you are selling a laptop bag you know that people are using a laptop right what other product could you be bundling with this laptop bag maybe it's a USB key that they need right it's a perfect combination now when I say bundling don't go and sell like a sock with a laptop bag people are gonna laugh at you just like I'm laughing at myself right now do something or provide another product that is actually related to the product you're selling so a USB key is absolutely useful because when people use laptops they're bound to save some stuff and uh, move it to a different computer right so a USB stick that has a good 
um, a good memory on it, like let's say like a 50 gig memory or a 25 gig memory, something great, right? That you can upsell with the product. So if your laptop bag is like $35, $40, you can upsell this product for $15, $20 more. Now, all of a sudden, you're selling two products at the same time. At the same time, there is nothing like it in the market because people sometimes don't think about these things outside of the box. They think, oh, laptop bag, I'm gonna just sell laptop bag. Why should I sell another thing with it, right? I'm telling you guys, they'll do wonders. People, well, if somebody needs a laptop and a USB key, they're gonna go to your listing and buy it because you have both of them together and you can provide some kind of discount to let them know that, hey, that because we have combined these two, uh, these two products together, you're getting a 10, 15, 20% discount because of it. So people will be more inclined to buy your product because it's something different. Not only it solves problems, it's actually making it better, right? And <coughs> it's adding to the value. That's it, you gotta create the perception of value. Your sale or your listing is more valuable than your competitors because you have upped your game, you have upped the quality, and you have upped the bar by actually providing additional value to it, which is the USB key. That's how we beat competition every time, that's how we differentiate our product every single time, and I urge you guys to always, always implement this in your business. Thank you guys, I hope you learned something valuable today. Give this video a thumbs up, subscribe, hit the bell button so you can get notifications on the next video, and I'm gonna see you guys next time, bye.